So we're halfway through this uh, morning session on quarterfinals day here on court two of uh, the Leaning China Masters 2023. It's a mixed doubles between the number five seeds, Deshapal Puavar Nukro and Sapsiri Teratanachano of Thailand, taking on Tang Chun Man and Seung Sweat of Hong Kong. That's the match that's coming up here on court two. We look at the mixed doubles draw, and uh, we've already seen Jiang Suwei and Huang Yachong, the top seeds, book their place in the semi finals. Now we're going to look at that bottom half of the draw, and the winner here between Thailand and Hong Kong China will either face Xiao and Che, the world champions, number four seeds, or Chang and Chan, a young upcoming Chinese pair in the semis, with the likes of the top seed or the Olympic champions, Feng and Huang waiting in the final. There they come. The fifth seeds, Deshapal Puavar Nukro and Sapsiri Teratanachai of Thailand leading the way, followed by the world number 11s, Tang Chun Man and Tse In Sweat of Hong Kong, China. And this one has also been a long-standing rivalry which has been heavily favoring the Thai pair. You see this, 7-1 is the head-to-head -head record. Yeah. Last Thailand meeting was the at the and Thailand is the championships. Bring door, bring door, bring door. Bring door. In the first round. Yeah. And the Thais won so that in straight games. And which side? This side, who will receive? Sapsiri will serve and saying Sweat will receive and uh, the Hong Kong China pair have chosen to play on the near end of the court. So the World Championships was their last meeting in the first round that the Thais won in straight games and the Malaysia Masters this year before that also first round that the Thai won in the straight games. And you see there now 31 years of age is Sapsiri Teratanachai from Udon Thani in Thailand, ranked number five in the world with her partner, Dechapol Puerto They have, of course, been former world number ones. Got to go back to December of 2021 to see that ranking. Have a win loss record of 38 to 18 in uh, 2023. The quarterfinal record is not the best, stands at five wins to seven losses. They've lost their last four quarterfinals. So they're going through a bit of a slump, if you can call it that. They beat Lamsfus and Lohau of Germany in straight games, 17 and 13 in 33 minutes, and then were pushed by another Hong Kong China pair in Li and Ang. Yesterday in the second round, coming back from a game down to win in three. Tara Tanajai and Puavara Nukro. Meanwhile, Tseung Sweat, now 32, celebrated her birthday on the 9th of November and is ranked 11th in the world with her partner, Tang Chun Ma. As you see there, they've gone up as high as number two. That was June of 2018. Have a win loss record of 30 to 21 this year. Tang Chun Ma, 28 years of old, both left handers, of course which is a very rare combination in the sport. At the quarterfinal stage, their win-loss record stands at 4-3. And they've won, more importantly, three of their last four quarterfinals. Beat Go Sun Huat and Shevon Jamie Lai in straight games in the first round, and then Ye Hong Wei and Lee Chia Sin pushed them all the way to three, coming through 57 minutes after dropping the first game were Tang and Tse. So similar kind of routes to this quarterfinal. Both these pairs have had. One thing that's glaring difference is that head-to-head -head record, of course. All, Ready to play. But one match has gone the Thai way. You'd have to look at the Asian Games in 2018 at the quarterfinal stage when Tang Chun Man and Tse Ying Sweat won their only game or only match against the Thais. Won that 21-13, 22-20. Shan Ju Hui is the umpire for this match and she'll be joined in the service judges chair 
by Liu Ching Yang, her compatriot. Three of eight of these previous matches between these two pairs have gone to three games. And if it does go to three games, the Thai have the record of winning all three previous three gamers against Tang and Sir. But that's some time to go. And the focus will be on getting the advantage in the opening game. And as we heard, it'll be Sapsiri Taratanachai who will serve to Sir Ying Sweat to get this quarterfinal underway. in the semi-finals here in Shenzhen. Sapsuri Teratanachai serves to get this quarter-final going. Just wide. I think they're challenging it, because it's just wide. It's easy challenge it, called out. It is indeed called out. And that's the first challenge we've had today here on court two. Surprisingly, it's match three. And we haven't had any challenges up until now. Yeah, that is in. That is a great challenge from saying sweat. It's on the line. And uh, must have spoken to their teammates, Lee and Ung, yesterday after they played the Thai pair to get any kind of intel. Which will certainly help them in their cause. Look at that, a quick fire, three love lead. Again, going wide. It's a careless mistake oh. from poor Varanukro. Oh. Pounced from that one. Five. Saying sweat. Love. No opportunity oh. for Taratanachai to retaliate. at the net from Sir uh, means the fifth seeds are finally on the scoreboard. long one we've seen in this game. And in the end, the smash goes wrong for Poor Varnukro. 
straight into the net instead. You could see Tang Chun Man. Ready to defend if required. It's the first tournament since the French Open for Puavaranokra and Teratanajai. They retired in that tournament in the second round with Teratanajai suffering a knee injury. So it's over two. Coming back from that here in Shenzhen. This will really test her fitness. Who finds the line? This arena has certainly woken up. Exciting atmosphere going around the entire arena with court one featuring one of the most favorite Three, players seven. in badminton in China, Huang Dongping, the Olympic champion. She with a new partner, Feng Yangzhe, are playing over on court one against Korea. And there's no surprise that the crowd is getting behind them. That's great defending by Sir. Look at that, how are they absorbing all these smashes in the end. Four, seven. It proves a little too much, but he had to smash his way through that exchange. Puavar Nukro. I know he's pretty strong, but that must have taken a physical toll. And here he goes again. Smart play. By saying sweat. Look at that. Changes direction. Sorry. Having to stretch to play it back. Serve. Four. Keeps it really tight. Five. Nine. Very small margins at the moment that these two pairs are playing with. Trying to get the net left. Tang Chun Man under pressure. Did anticipate that well, but not able to get the height on the net shot. China bear doing well just to keep the gap, have some sort of cushion going into the mid-game break. Ah. Oh, let that go well, because that went long from poor yeah, Nukro. And so it's Tang and Tse who have the five-point advantage at the mid-game break.
Japan. They have made the brighter start here in this quarterfinal. ดูดีให้เห็นให้เห็นเค้ายืนก่อนเอบีหรือซีดีเนอะแล้วโจมตีตรงนี้ตรงนี้ก่อนเริ่มจากตรงนี้เรื่องนี้เพื่ออะไร
smash. Super defense by Hong Kong China there. Look at that shot. That was stunning from Saying Sweat. She exploited that space on the court so well. On the defense, she just kept playing the shuttle until she found herself in a position where she could redirect it into the open spot. Yeah, she'll be happy with that. Seven point lead. Oh, they pushed along a fair bit, aren't they? Seem to be playing catch up for Varno Krantara Tanachai. Almost reacting to the shots versus trying to take control. Oh, straight points for Tang and Sir. We've not really relinquished the lead since this opening game started. Always stayed ahead. Trying to get Terra Tanajai to play more. That's gone wide. Miscommunication between the two. 17, 8. But I think they're definitely trying to get Terra Tanajai to play more. Because Kuovar Nukro has been definitely the aggressor. Trying to take charge. Whereas Terra Tanajai has sat back a little bit in this opening game. Did give chase there, saying sweat, but you can see that possibly was going to fall right outside the lines. But this for a run, six straight points for Tang and Sir at a very crucial time in the game. Oh, she missed that return. So over. Nine, 18. Three points away from clinching the opener. Yeah. So it's that is an assured 19, player out caught out there saying sweat. She seems very put together with regards to her shots. Defend at the moment, Tang and Sir. We'll see a change shortly. Ah, oh, missed it completely. Maybe just getting impatient with the clears that were being played. Try to take the initiative there. Saying Sweat was just happy to play the clears, and then Tang Chun Man steps in on the backcourt, tries to change the play. Still a nine point lead here.
a good rally. Seeing a little bit of everything. Yeah, missed that again. Annoyed with himself there, Tang Chun Man. Six point run that they made at twelve eight. It's coming in handy now for Tang and Sir. Try to close out this opening game. Chang and Sir, in terms of concentration, in terms of energy. Oh, I It's a very different tactic that the ties are adopting, Just playing the defensive game, putting the pressure on the Hong Kong pair. A nice change for the net game. Oh, lovely. Took a bit of magic from Tang Chun Man to get to game point. Nice drop shot. Delightfully played. But I think that's what the ties were trying to do is try to put the pressure on Tang and Sir to come up with the goods because they'll be keen to close out this game. So we saw a lot more defensive play from the number five seeds. And while it worked for a couple of rallies, I think Tang and Sir have understood what they need to do. That's gone wide, and it is Tang Chun Man and saying Sweat of Hong Kong, China, who have the opening game 21 12. They led from start to finish in this opener. And after 21 minutes, we have the advantage. Oh. 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 ไม่ได้อยู่ในเรื่องแผนการเล่นใหม่ปรับเกมไม่ดีแล้วถึงจังหวะเวลาเขาเคลื่อนที่ปุ๊บแค่เคลื่อนที่เหนียวเคลื่
game two. And it will be Tang Chun Man who will serve to get this underway. Accepted that. <laughs> and while he took a few more shots, Tang and Sir get themselves on the scoreboard. Well, they're doing this very, very quickly. Tang and Sir. Not giving their ties any time to settle in. Five, one. And now with a change of ends. Fifth seeds have the extra burden of managing the drift in these slow conditions. Six. Apologize straight away because it does catch the tape and roll over. Five straight points. Sorry, six straight points for Chang and Sir now. It's a good start. Oh, nice. Look at that. She found that space so easily. Goes behind Povar Nukro, who's made a commitment to move sideways by then. How quick is this?
Big hitting. So hard. Gets them another point. Opens up the seven point lead. Tang Chun Man doing all the damage from the back court. Second appearance for the Hong Kong China pair at this event. Played in 2018, but they lost in the first round there to Owen Fung in three games. So this is their best outing at the Super 750 event. And what a showing they've made against the fifth seeds. 10 2 up now. Another mistake from Pua Varnukro means it's Tang and Se who take the lead 11-2 at the break. They have pretty much picked up from where they left off in the opening game. And they've done it even faster in the second. Just eight minutes played and they have a nine-point lead, Tang and Se. ยับยับใส่เค้าหน่อยเดินเหมือนเดิมเหมือนยับยับใส่เค้าหน่อยเห็นอะไรบ้างไม่ได้เกี่ยวกับต้องแรงนะมันเกี่ยวกับทิศท
had the Malaysia Masters title in the bag this year when they beat Feng and Huang in the final in three games. Well defended. It's a big smash. One going wide on the cross net shot. They also got to the finals at the Thailand Open, where they lost to Korea's Kim and Jeong in three. Then at the Japan Open, they lost to Watanabe and Higashino in three. So they've had a fairly successful year for their standards. The injury sort of stopping their momentum a little bit. And straight four. The body shot there, Taratana Chai. It's almost like she's saying she's had enough. Seven. Good low serve. Hard to return. Good play from both the Thai players starting the attack from the back court and then Teratanachai with the follow up at the net. That's what we've been waiting to see from these two. But how about this for a run now? Six points in a row. They've closed the gap to five. They were 4 14 down. So they were 2 14 down. And six in a row. Tang and Sir. A little bit desperate to end that run by the fifth seeds. <laughs> and they've done just that. Need to hold on to this lead that they've built. And close it out in two. That will be perfect response. Yeah. It was a, a really good serve to begin with, and then Provan Nukula and Taratana try with their returns. Lifting the shuttle even higher to kill off. Four points away from a place in the semis are Tang and Sir. Who from one all really have led from the front. Oh, uh, that is a glorious shot. As she was on the floor trying to reach it. Look how low he had to take that shot, Kovar Nukro, and he gets it over. Just about. It's a brave shot when you're 9 17 down. This is 
good pressure that the ties continue to put. And you see the mistakes coming off the Hong Kong China players' rackets. Arena is going off with Feng and Huang on the verge of clinching a win on court one. Service error. Indeed, won their match. Oh, straight at the net. He drives it. Must be hard to play in this noise, but it's becoming an impossible task now for Poor Varanakro and Taratanachai. were effective for Tang Chun Man in the backcourt. Got those steep angles and he sets up numerous match point opportunities at 2012. Looking for their first semi-final here. Yeah, easy pickings in the end for Tang Chun Man and saying Sweat who defeat the number five seeds, Deshapal, Puavar, Nukro, and Sapsiri Teratanachai to book their place in the semi-finals of the China Masters for the very first time. The follow-up from Tsoying Sweat there, she made no mistake going behind Puavar, Nukro. And they're through to their fifth semi-final of 2023 as a result. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Moise. So 21-12, 12 in 42 minutes. It's Tang Chun Man and Seng Sweat who are through to the semi-finals here in Shenzhen. The end of the road for the number five seeds, but what a performance for Tang and Se here on court two as they secure a straight games win. 21-12, 21-12. And that's through to the final four after 41 minutes of play.